ವಂದೆ ಗುರುಪದ್ವಂದ ಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಸಮನ್ವಿತ ಶ್ರೀಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ವಂದೆ ನಿಂದಸಹೋದ ಶ್ರೀ ನಂದ ನಂದ ನಂಗ ವಂದೆ ರಾಧಿಕ ಚರುಣೋದಯ ಗೋಪೀಜನ ಸಮಯುಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದಾವನ ಮನೋಹರ ವಾಂಛಾಕಲ್ಪತರು ವಶಕಿ ಪಾಸಿಂದು ಬೆವಚ ಪತಿ ಪಾವನೇಭ್ಯ ವೈಷ್ಣವೇಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಮೂಕಂಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚಾಲಂಗ ಪಂಗುಂಗ್ಲಂಗ ಹೈತಿ ಗಿರಿ ಯತ್ಕಿ ಪಾತಮಹಂಗ ವಂದಿ ಪರಮಾನಂದ ಮಾಧವ ಬಿಂದಾವೈ ತುಸಿ ದೇವೈ ಪಿಯಾವೈ ಕೇಶವಸ ಕೃಷ್ಣಭಕ್ತಿ ಪದೆ ದೇವಿ ಸತ್ವತ್ವೈ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ ನರುಂಚ ನರೋತ್ತಮ ದೇವಿ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತಥೋ ಜಯೋ ಮುದೀರ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶ ಗೌರೀಯ ಪತ್ರಶ ಪ್ರಕಾಶನೆ ಚಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರುಭಕ್ತಿಯುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮೋದಾಕ್ಷ ಜಗೋದ್ವರುಣ್ಯ ಧ್ಯೇಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವಗ್ನ ವಿಷ್ಣುದೂಹಂ ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದ ಶಿವಿರಂಚನು ತಂ ಶರಣ್ಯ ಭೀತಾತ್ಯಹಂ ಪನುತಪಾಲುಭವಾದಿಪೂತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರುಷ ತೆ ಚರುಣಾರವಿಂದ ಯತ್ಪಾದಪಲ್ಲವನಖಚಂದಮನಿ ಛಟಾಯ ವಿಸ್ಫುರಜೀತ ಕಿಮಿ ಗೋವಧೂಷ್ವದರ್ಶಿ ಪೂರ್ಣಾನುರಾಗರಸಸಾಗರ ಸಾರಮೂರ್ತಿ ಸಾರಾಧಿ ಕಾಮಿ ಕದಾ ಕೃಪಾಂ ಕರೋಸಿ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನೇತ್ತನಂದ ಸಿಯಾದ್ವೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನೇತ್ತನಂದ ಸಿಯಾದ್ವೈತ ಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೆ ಆಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತ ಭುಜೌ ಕನಕಾ ಬದಾತ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೈಕಪಿತರೌ ಕಮಲಾಯತಾಕ್ಷ ವಿಶಾಂಬರೌ ದ್ವಿಜವರೌ ಜುಗಧರ್ಮಪಾಲೌ ವಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ಪ್ರಿಯಕರು ಕರುಣಾಭತಾರು ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ನಮಿ ಗಂಗೆ ತವ ಪಾದ ಪಂಕಜ ಸುರಸುರೈರ್ಬಂಧಿ ದಿವ್ಯೂಪ ಭುಕ್ತಿ ಚ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ಚದಿ ನಿತ್ಯ ಭಾವಾನುಪೇನ್ನ ಸದಾ ನರಾನ ಗಂಗಾತರಂಗರಮಣೀಯ ಜಟಾಕಲಾಪ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರ ವಿಭೂಷೀ ತ್ವಾಮ ಭಾಗ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಪ್ರಿಯ ಮನಂಗ ಮದಾಪಹಾರ ವರಾನಸಿ ಪುರಪತಿ ಭಜ ವೀಶನಾಥ ಬಾಗೀಶಜುಷ್ವದನೆ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀರ್ಜಶ ವಕ್ಷಸೆ ಯಸ್ತಿ ಹೃದಯ ಸಂಬೀರ್ ತ್ವ ನಿಶಿಂಗಮಹಂ ಭಜೆ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ 
तदेव रम्मम रुचिम नवम नवम तदेव साक्षात मनसो महोत्सव तदेव शोकर्णव शोषण नीनाम जदुत्तम श्लोक जसो अनुगीय से तदेव रम्मम रुचिम नवम नवम तदेव साक्षात मनसो महोत्सव तदेव शोकर्णव शोषण नीनाम जदुत्तम श्लोक जसो अनुगीय से गौरी गोष्ठीपति श्री शिला भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर प्रभुपात जगत गुरु टोल्ड वी आर मोर और लेस कॉन्टामिनेटेड विथ मायावाद विचार गौरी गोष्ठीपति श्री शिला भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर प्रभुपात जगत गुरु टोल्ड मोर और लेस वी आर ऑल कॉन्टामिनेटेड विथ मायावाद विचार मोस्ट ऑफ आस नॉट दैट एवरीबॉडी बट मोस्ट ऑफ आस कंटेमिनेटेड विथ मायावाद विचार वी आर वैष्णव हाउ यू से वी आर कंटेमिनेटेड विथ मायावाद विचार गौरी गोष्ठीपति पॉप आर स्पीकिंग वाट इज द बेसिक थियोरी ऑफ मायावाद I was discussing yesterday. What is the basic, most basic bichar of Mayabha? Those who are contaminated with Mayabha, those who are contaminated with Mayabha, they don't have hundred percent believe in Guru Vishnu. They believe, okay. They believe, okay. But hundred percent, they don't believe. they are not going to believe 100% dam nam parikar vaishishtya even mahaprasadam today chana rasa or sweet ball what prasad oh i have no appetite so more or less we are all contaminated with mayavad vichar mayavad vichar mean basically we can mayavad vichar mean they don't have 100% believe in guru vishnu bhagwan naam dham prasad many time i discuss you can remember maha prasade govinde namai brahmane vishnabe salpa punnam batan rajan vishwasanai vayate sharira vidya jal jarendiya tahe idhi na every day but you understand the meaning You read every day. Pope was speaking that those who are, you know, Maya, those who are contaminated with Maya Bhad, I mean, not full faith in Guru Vishnu, Bhagwan, Nam Dham, they are not going to believe hundred percent in Rasa. That's why big problem. All our previous acharyas, especially I am speaking about four sampradayik acharyas. Because four sampradaya acharyas, four sampradaya are already approved by Bhagwan. All other sampradaya, they are not hundred percent authentic. Four authentic sampradaya given. Four sampradaya. In Padma Purana, it is written. संप्रदाय विहीना ये मंत्र हस्ते निष्फलामत संप्रदाय विहीना ये मंत्र हस्ते निष्फलामत दोज आर नॉट गोइंग टू हैव ए डायरेक्ट लिंक विथ एनी ऑफ दोज फोर संप्रदाय दे कैन नॉट रीच दे आर गोल फॉलोवर है से दोज हु हैव नो डायरेक्ट कनेक्शन With any of these four sampradayas, four sampradayas mean I already told. Ramanuj Shab, you know, Nimbark sampraday, Vishnu Swami sampraday, Ramanuj sampraday, Madhya Charjya sam. Those are the four authentic sampraday prescribed in Shastra. If you have any direct link with that parampara. then you can 
have the chance to reach the goal. Otherwise not. Most of the people, they have a wrong conception about different branches. Like one example I can see, Prabhupada speaking, I am not speaking. You think Ramanuja Sampradaya and Ramanandi Sampradaya, you think same. Most probably, most probably, most probably you have wrong conception about this point that Ramanuja Sampradaya and Ramanandi Sampradaya, you think almost same, not same. Papa speaking, if you go through their Siddhanta Vichar, the way of Bhajan, then you can find a big disparity. They are not same. Ramanandi Swami, they had a 14th successive, 14th successive, you know, in line, Acharya line, but deviated. Mode of bhajan, goal of bhajan, almost different. This way, due to time and circumstances, and due to the magic spell of Maya, people are going deviated from the exact track, Sampradaya. I am not going to blame anybody. I am not going to blame anybody. It is one kind of magic spell of Maya. Nobody can avoid. So, in Sampradaya we find, The question of Guru Parampara, the question of Sampradik Parampara, Sampradayik Parampara, the authenticity of Sampradayik Parampara, depending upon this vital point. Don't misunderstand me. Don't become angry with me. I am sitting to speak about the absolute truth. It is my request. Don't misunderstand me. The authenticity of Guru Parampara, the authenticity of Guru Parampara, the utility of Guru Parampara is going to depend upon this vital point that all successive Acharya should be in line. Tolo. Like Ganga coming from Gomuk, you know Gomuk? From Gomuk, Himalayan. Ganga coming, Gama, Ganga, Sri Ganga traveling to different places. If I ask you, I need some Ganga water, could you give me? He say yes. You are going to another river, Ajay, Ajay Nadi or Damodar. You are getting water, you giving to me. I say it's Ganga water. No, actually, I, it's not Ganga water. Because Ganga is not flowing, flowing through that place. So, Ajay river, Nuda, Nadi, Ajay river, that, that water is not same as Ganga water. To get Ganga water, you will have to, to get, to get Ganga water, you will have to follow the track of Ganga. Which way Ganga is flowing? And there, you will have to take trouble to go there and get collected. Otherwise I, am, otherwise, I am not ready to admit that you are getting Ganga water. So, the authenticity of Guru Parampara, the utility of Guru Parampara is, is you, know, de, you know, depend upon this vital point. Whether this Guru Parampara, successive Guru Parampara coming through me, up to me, up to me, you can believe me? or not. Blindly you cannot believe me. It is my request. It is my request to you, don't blindly believe me. You try to see Siddhanta Bichar, my character, my acharan, my etiquette, my bhava, everything in line with my Guru Bhargav not. You should watch this point. So, blind Guru Parampara, we cannot accept. 
that is the utility of this Guru Parampara, authentic Guru Parampara, that I today, still today, still today, Siman Mahaprabhu gone away from this material world. 550 years almost over. Still miracle, still today, by the mercy of Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Goswami Tagore Prabhupada, I have the chance to get the same intact teaching. Follow my point. Still today, I have the scope to get the same teaching. What Mahapu wanted to give that time. Follow my point. Scientific point. Not false philosophy. I have the facility to get the same teaching of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu through Bhaktivinoda Thakur, through Prabhupada, through Kesav Goswami Maharaj. Follow. Even through Bhaman Goswami Maharaj, I am speaking. I mean, Parampara, I am speaking. All of our, those who are authentic Guru Parampara, those who are in line, I can get. Those who are deviated, surely, 100, 100 percent. They are deviated men, they are not successful. And their followers, they are also not successful. Excuse me. They are not successful. At the same time, their followers, they are also failure. Even it is written in Bhagavatam, they can go to hell. It is written in Bhagavatam. They can go to hell. They cannot get in. It is supported by Shastra. I am not making any dry philosophy. Many times before I told about this point, maybe you forget. You know, it is written, Jo Bhakti Nairohitam. It is written in Shastra. Jo Bhakti Nairohitam Annayena Srinatiya To Ubho Brajataha Nirayam Kalam Akshayam. For infinity period, they can go to hell. Those who are not going to sing the glories of Guru Vaishnava Bhagavan authentic way. Follow. Authentic way, man. Bani Vaibhav coming to me. If I am not going to take help of that Bani Parampara, Shauta Parampara, you heard that is the word? Shauta Parampara, you heard now? The name of Veda is Shruti. Shruti, why? The name of Veda is Shruti, why? From ancient prior, right from the beginning, it was the system that the disciples, they are so meritorious, they used to memorize all Veda by hearing from Guru. By hearing from Guru. Continue. Guru, they are speaking in Vyasasana. Disciple hearing, recorded. Like computer, you know. Every time you are doing job, fed, memory, you know, you will have to save. If you fail to save, you, if you fail to you know, press the save button, any, anything problem can happen. Whole, your work can go away, vanish. It happens so. So, it was the system that time, by hearing all Veda, Vedanta, everything, they used to memorize everything. So, if I am not in line with my Guru Parampara, if I am going to memorize some false philosophy written by somebody and going to get some clapping to you, oh, nice philosophy you are speaking. Then my Harikatha is not actual Harikatha. Then, then my Harikatha is not actual Harikatha because it is not in line with my Guru Varga, Siddhanta Vichar, all, everything. It's not in Sauta Parampara. The slok just now I told, what is the meaning? Jo Bhakti, Bhakti Manaju, who is speaking wrong Siddhanta, which is not in line with Guru Parampara. Jo Bhakti, Nairahitam, illegal katha. Illegal katha, I cannot support it. Why are you speaking? When he is our Guru Varga. No, he is not Guru Varga. 
I can give example. I can give example from the character behavior of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. When Chaitanya Mahaprabhu here, some somebody going to inform Mahaprabhu, Prabhu, Brahmananda Bharati coming. Eh? Brahmananda Bharati, where, where? Where? He already come to Purushottam Dham. Try to remember this Siddhanta. Otherwise, people can try people can try to fight with me, but cannot try. They cannot fight. Because I have document. When Chaitanya Mahaprabhu was informed that Brahmananda Bharati coming. Mahaprabhu, where? Brahmananda Bharati. Ah, we can I can bring him here? No, he's Guru Varga. I can go to him to meet. Mahaprabhu speaking. He's Guru Varga. I can go to meet him. Where is he? Hey, there, you come with me. He's going. When going and Mahaprabhu watching, Brahmananda Prabhu wearing tiger skin, tiger skin, not cloth. Brahmananda, Brahmananda Bharati wearing tiger skin. And Mukunda speaking, where, where is Brahmananda Bharati? Well, here you are. That is not Brahmananda Bharati. How Brahmananda Bharati can wear tiger skin? Mahaprabhu knows he is Brahmananda Bharati. <laughs> Mahaprabhu knows very well. Where is Brahmananda Bharati? Here you are, in front of you. <laughs> Useless, foolish. Onnore, onno kaha. Nahi you have no common sense. You are speaking Brahmananda Brahmananda Bharati can never wear tiger skin. Then Brahmananda Bharati could immediately could realize that Prabhu don't like that I wear tiger skin. Immediately throw tiger skin, wear a nice cloth. Then, hey, here you are, Brahmananda. Don't know what. Our Guru Bhargava teaching us that the mood of Brahmananda Bharati, the mood of Brahmananda Bharati to wear tiger skin was not approved by Mahaprabhu as Siddhanta. Maybe Mahaprabhu respect Brahmananda Bharati, but that thing Mahaprabhu don't allow. So anyway, we must be very careful because the slok speaking, those who are going to speak illegal katha, which is not supported by your Guru Bhargava, authentic Guru Bhargava. Maybe it's very tasty. Huh? Maybe it's very, hunger is the base sauce, you know. When you have no appetite, you are using some sauce. Then you are taking chapati. But what is the utility of sauce if you are very hungry? You can take four chapati, five chapati, very quickly. Hunger is the base sauce. So, if you have, you know, if you have, you know, that kind of mentality to speak all rubbish, you have not feeling any taste in Guru Parampara, the Siddhanta, you are making new thing, totally new thing to you have. Then you are deviated. That's why it is written in Shastra, that jo bhakti nairohitam onnayana srinitu yo. Those who are going to hear, those who are going to speak wrong siddhanta, those who are going to hear wrong siddhanta, both of them. Shastra speaking, those who are speaking wrong siddhanta, and those who are going to attain that harikatha, both of them can go to. Jo bhakti nairohitam onnayana srinitu yo to ubho brajataha nirayam Kala Makshayam, you can go to hell. Pitama Visha also, you know, protest against Gurudev. Pitama Visha, our, our 12, out of 12 Mahajan is going on. Eh? Pitama Visha speaking, that kind of Guru who has no common sense, speaking all rubbish, not following Shastra, should be discarded. You should discard that kind of guru. Kajya kajyo majad utpatapati pannyasya parityag vidhiyati Who is going to advise wrong Siddhanta, all everything wrong? 
Pitama Vishu. One Mahajan out of twelve Mahajan speaking. Thus there are no conception about what to speak, what not to speak, what kind of behavior of a guru should do. Oh, I am guru. You are protected by money, you are protected by manpower, you are protected by your society, but you are not protected by Nityananda Prabhu. Main protection is Nityananda. Your authenticity can be tested by your mood, how much you are following, how far, how much you are going to follow. It's called now point is that today is the Tirubhaptiti of Srila Ramanuja Charjo. Great. Many times Popad used to discuss about Ramanuja Charjo. All our Bhakti Thakur, a great Ramanuja Charjo. Ramanuja Charjo means Ram Anujo Acharjo. In Bakaran, Sanskrit grammar, if you split up, Ram Anuja plus Acharya, mean the younger brother of Ramji, the younger brother of Sri Ramchandra. He coming here in the form of Ramanuja, Charya. When Ramanuja is near Madurai, near Madurai city, Madras, Mahabhutapuram, the name of the place is Bhutapuram, there, Ramanuja Jo took birth in a very high sophisticated family, very nishtha, you know, very perfection. A value of a Vaishnava, value of a Shadu, depend upon his accurate behavior, acharan, here loveful heart, not depend upon the post he is going to sit. Not depend on. A value of a Vaishnava Guru, Guru Vaishnava, depend upon this main factor. How much he is following perfect acharan, purity of mind and heart, external purity, internal purity. If you only maintain external purity and try to take bath, wash your clothes, it's not. You will have to maintain both internal purity and external purity. If you avoid external purity, it's not good. Those who are Paramahansa Acharya like Madhavendu Puripad, Ishwar Puripad, if externally, if externally, if you, externally, if you find their external purity is not so good, but still is good. You can discover Madhavendu Puripad not going to take bath, whereas you are going to take bath four o'clock, eh? four five five o'clock. You think Madhavandu Prabhu is not taking bath? Foolish now, idiot number one. He is also already taking bath all the time by Harinam. Haridas Thakur taking bath the Harinam. They are already taking bath. You are blind, you cannot see. That's why I can discuss this point when Tiruvaptiti of Madhavandu Puripad coming, I can discuss. Madhavandu Puripad praying to Supreme Lord, oh Prabhu. I have no time to take bath. Madhavindu was speaking. Shandhya vandanam namas tubhyam bho snan tubhyam namaha. Mean? Ho Shandhya vandan. I have no time to chant tannik. I have no time to take bath. What do you say? Yes. Shandhya vandanam namas tubhyam. I pay dandavat to you. Please excuse me. I have no time. Follow. Sandha vandanam namas tubhyam bho snan tubhyam namaha. Oh, you know, I am going to take bath. You know, beg for excuse because I have no time to take bath. But you will have to follow rules. You cannot follow Euro culture. If you follow, contaminated. So, main purity is to remember. Main purity is to remember Bhagavan inside out. Anyway, 
Srila Ramanujaj was taking birth in a very high sophisticated acharanful family in Mahabhutapuram, there in South India. In fact, all four Acharyas, they are all taking birth in South India. In fact, all four Acharyas, they are all taking birth in South India. Men, if you have any link with that, any of those four Sampradayak Acharya, then your bhajan is authentic, otherwise not. We are deviated. The name of the father of Ramanuja Acharya was a Kesava Acharya. Kesava Acharya. The name of father of Ramanuja Acharya was Kesava Acharya. And mother is Kanti Moti. Mother name Kanti Moti and father Kesava Acharya. Follow what I say. One younger brother of Kanti Moti. One younger brother of Kanti Moti. I mean the maternal uncle of Ramanujaj. He was the disciple of Jamun Muni, the great Jamun Muni, Jamuna Charjo. Great Jamunu Charjo. When he heard that my elder sister, when he heard that my elder sister, she has given birth to a very nice boy, baby, running to watch the you know mouth of that you know small boy, and he is watching. He is great devotee. He is a great devotee. He is enjoying Guru Kipa, full Guru Kipa, Jamuna Charjo. He is watching the boy and speaking. It's not normal boy. It's not normal boy. He is watching all the symptom. He's speaking all the symptom of hand, leg, head, everything. It's going to prove that he is the younger brother of Ramchandra. He, because he know in Sastra like our Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, like Bhagavan Sri Krishna, like Radharani, you know, the, the footprint of Radharani you have seen? You can put footprint. I can give you. Footprint of Ra Gaur Nityananda is very auspicious. And footprint of Radha Govinda you can put here, somewhere. Very nice place. Footprint. Follow. He is watching and speaking. He is a, a Ramanuja. I mean the younger brother of Ramchandra. So he is going to give the name of the boy as a Lakshman. As a Lakshman, Lakshman Deshi. Lakshman. Lakshman, you know? Lakshman is the younger brother of Ramchandra. Lakshman. So Lakshman, now I'm growing up gradually. Very super, super intelligent. Anything, anybody reading, anybody, hey, you read? One time, remember. So high intelligent, all complete, within eight years, nine years, complete, all Sastra almost. Oh, so high intelligent. Abnormal, it's impossible. It's ordinary people, it's impossible. And after that, by the permission of Father, I mean, Kesava Charyo, he wanted to read further. Further mean? Ved, Vedanta, etc. I like to, because that time uh, in South India there was a big importance of Vedanta because Shankaracharya is, Shankaracharya took birth more before. Shankaracharya, Adi Shankaracharya took more before. So, Shankaracharya was so influential personality. Uh, also, he was uh, getting the support of Bhagavan because uh, Bhagavan sent him. So naturally, he was successful to, you know, preach Mayavad Siddhanta. So naturally, whole South India, whole, whole South India, almost whole South India, they are also having some influence of Sankaracharya. I already told many of our previous, you know, Guru Bhargav, I mean, in they sometimes taking one danda, one danda, you know, one danda, ek danda. 
it is a, it is a, it is the evidence they are going to take egg danda one danda you know one danda one danda this one danda is is mayavad bichar but our madhavendra puri part taking one danda but you should not misunderstand them because that time that time our Prabhupada no Saraswati Bhat, he was also taking one run. Because that, was, that time, that time it was the usual rule. That time it was the usual, anybody taking one run. But that doesn't mean they are going to think, but to remember, don't forget. The, usually they are going to take, it was the usual practice. But that doesn't mean you cannot blame them. Why you are taking one run? One run is Mahabhat. Okay, Mahabhat. But our Guru Varga, Bhakti Thakur and Prabhupada, they are going to teach us that though you can find one danda externally, but they, ha they conceive, they have the conception, right conception, that three, three, three danda is there inside. Though externally you can find one danda, you can find externally one danda. But in one danda, they are going to think, the three, three danda is there. I mean, kai man bakyo. By body, speech and mind, by body, speech, by body, speech and mind, if you are going to give punishment to body, speech and mind, I mean controlling, I mean to engage all and everything for Krishna Seva, Bhagavad Seva, that is called danda. Danda mean? Danda mean not that you are taking danda and pity, not that. Danda mean to control your body, speech and mind, kāyaman bhakka, you are going to engage all them in the service of Bhagavan, not in the service of Maya. That is the secret conception of Tidanda. Mahaprabhu taking one danda, so what? Mahaprabhu taking one danda, and for Mahaprabhu, it is not wrong. For Mahaprabhu, it is not wrong, because Mahaprabhu can say, Om Brahma, because Mahaprabhu himself Bamba. For Mahaprabhu is not wrong. Mahaprabhu taking one run, and Mahaprabhu can say Om Brahma, but still Mahaprabhu never going to teach this way. There is a speciality. Very careful. Mahaprabhu, Mahaprabhu, could, Mahaprabhu could easily say the Om Brahma, but never tell. Because Mahaprabhu coming as Acharya to teach us, Bhakti. Mahaprabhu say, I am, I am, don't speak. If somebody is speaking, Namanaran, don't speak like that. I am a teeny soul, Jivatma. You are going to, you know, think I am Naran. Oh my God, don't speak that. Mahaprabhu is going to teach this way. Bonded soul never can become Naran. Ah, don't speak. I am not Brahma. I am fallen soul. Mahaprabhu is going to teach. So, same conception going to touch, same conception of Mahaprabhu going, going to touch the heart of those pure devotees. Like our Madhavendu Puripad, Ishwar Puripad, oh, Prabhupada Sar. Though externally you can find one danda, but actually three danda is there. They are acharan can speak that they have three danda, teen danda, inside. This way, Ramanusha Jo actually, uh, Ramanusha Jo, Madha Jo, all, yeah, actually that time, South India total was, you know, almost dominated by Mayavad Vichar, but now changing, still today, they are not going to understand pure bhakti. Pure Bhakti means Gauriya Bhakti, shown by Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Still today cannot accept. Maximum, they can, they can try to understand Madhacharya Darshan. No, no, follow. Shuddha Dvaitava. Or maximum, they can come in line with Ramanujajya, Vishishtha Dvaitava. Eh? This. This way they are, they cannot understand the secret bhajan mode of Gauriya society, still today, Prabhupada speaking. Anyway, 
Ramanushadjo took decision to go to Kanchipuram. At present name is Kanji Kanji Bharam. At present name is Kanji Bharam. That time the name of Kanji 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 Bharam is Kanchipuram. Because Kanchipuram, Lakshman Deshik, I mean the name of Ramanusha, the previous name. Lakshman Deshik thinking, taking, taking decision to go to Kanji Varam, Kanchipuram, to learn Vedanta from one great Acharya. Great? I am not speaking great. It is the wrong conception of people. It is the wrong conception of people that he is a great Acharya, Vedanta, people speaking, foolish people. But it is not authentic. What Ramanujaja took decision to go there, he is having, you know, big knowledge in Vedanta, so he took decision to go there. In Kanchipuram, in Kanchipuram, he is going to learn Vedanta from whom? From this Jadav Acharya. One Acharya in Mayabadi Sampradaya, he used to teach Vedanta. Ramanucharya is not Mayabadi. I already told his Ram Anuja is a brother of Ramchand. How he can tolerate? He is going to serve, it is a system that you will have to serve Gurudev. Eh? Pani, eh? Tadbiddhi. Tadbiddhi panipateno paripasnano sevaya upodekshantite gyanam gyanina stattva darshinaha. In Gita, you can have the guidance how you can get tattva gyan. If you are going to serve, if you are going to serve Gurudev, and a tattva gyani, not ordinary Guru, tattva gyani Gurudev from heart, going to hear Harikatha, everything from heart. Pranipat, you will have to pray prostrate dandavat, I mean beg for pardon, I mean to prove your humbleness, hundred percent humbleness, not do no duplicity is allowed. So pranipateno, pariposhna, you should put question in front of Guru Vaishnava, Tattva Jnana Guru, how I can do bhajan, please give me advice, this way, humble mood, on seva, three condition. If you can prove that you are going to satisfy, if you can prove that you are going to satisfy three condition, three condition to get Tattva Jnan, then surely you can get Tattva Jnan from Tattva Jnani Purush. Ramanujaj is also going to follow this procedure. He is going to serve Gurudev. Hearing Arikata, Pei Dandava, Prostate Dandava. But day by day, Lakshman Desik watching Gurudev explaining wrong way. Gurudev not explaining bhakti cult. One day, Lakshman Desik messaging the backside of Gurudev by oil before taking bath. And Gurudev is messaging and Gurudev explaining Vedanta and Upanishad. He is speaking one Upanishad sloka you know, he is going to compare the lotus eyes of Narayan. He is going to, I mean the Guru, Mayabadi Guru, Jadava Charjo, whom Lakshman is going to accept. It is one kind of Leela. Not that Lakshman is is idiot. He is one kind of Leela. He is going to prove. He is going to take, you know, lesson from Jadava Charjo. But when hearing, Day by day, Lakshman is watching, he is explaining wrong way, but cannot protest, he is Guru. One day he is messaging the backside, Gurudev lying, while he is going to explain. I mean, Jadavaja is speaking, the lotus eyes of Bhagavan is reddish in color. Lotus flower is reddish in color, no? Jadavacharya is going to compare the lotus in beauty of the lotus eyes of Bhagavan with the backside of monkey. Backside, you know? Monkey going on, just a cloacal, cloacal, you know, an, you know, anal. 
cloacal system, just there, which is very dirty. He is going to compare her with just with the backside of monkey, which is uh, totally illegal. Huh? Then Lakshman Desik started crying, hot water rolling down his cheeks, huh? and going to fall down on the backside of Gurudev. Gurudev, look. You cry? Why? Gurudev, I feel very, I feel pain because you are going to compare the lotus eyes of Bhagavan with the backside of monkey. How I can be a Supreme Lord? Foolish idiot. How you can explain? Gurudev going to chide. Hup! Idiot. Going to argument with me? How you can explain? Ramanujan speaking, Gurudev, if I explain this way, Tashoba Yatha. Tashoba Yatha. Kapyasam. Pundarika Eva. You know. Nayanam. Tashoba Yatha. Tashoba Yatha. Kapyasam. Uh, pundarika, uh, pundarika, uh, this kind of, you know, I see, I can remember just now, this word. Tashoba yatha kapyasam pundarika meva akshini. I mean the lotus eyes of Bhagavan can be compared with what? Like sun going to rise, na? Sun going to rise, that time... You know, red is in color when sun going to rise. When sun going to rise, you can find red is color in the east portion. Ramanuja is going to explain in such a way. Kapyasam. Ramanuja is going to explain this word. Kapyasam means you can explain two ways. One way, dirty way, explained by Jadavacharya. Eh? Kopi mean Sanskrit, Kopi mean monkey. Kapyasan, Kopi asan. I mean the backside of monkey is monkey sitting, na? Kapyasan. This way I can explain Kapyasam. Another way, Ramanuja Jo, I mean Lakshman Deshi wanted to explain. What is that? Kong Pibati. Kong mean water. Sun God going to drink water, na? By strong, scorchy sunlight, scorchy sunlight. Sun going to drink all water from, you know, water press. Follow what I say. Sun God taking, na? Water from different ponds, sea, river, by sun, sun God's sunlight and vapor going on. Kong Pivoti. Kong pivoti. Kong in water, pivoti. You know? And ash dhatu, ash. In Sanskrit, ash, ash dhatu, ash. Ash dhatu means to express in full form, like the lotus flower, this way. When sunlight there, express in full form, full bloom. So Ramanuchajo wanted to explain that kapyasam, this word, Gurudev, I can explain this way. Kong pivati, Kong pivati, the sun god, Mitro. Kong pivati, who is, who is drinking water from different words of the sun god? So, Kong pivati. Yeah. And as kapyasam, asam means, yes. You know, just like when the sun going to rise in the east, then become red is in color. We can dream, we can imagine that the reddish lotus flower is there when the sun going to rise in Surya Mandal and the tall effulgence of sun there we can conceive that Narayan is there, his lotus eyes is just red is in color. So beautiful. Follow. 
Then Jadavarcharju was shocked. Oh my God. Oh my God, the small boy going to explain, going to defeat me. Then Jadavarcharju is going to give some argument. Well, it's good, but not it is actually main, you know, it is not primary explanation. Jadavarcharju is going to use, you know, going to put some argument. To stand his own position, no? No, it is not actual definition. Huh? What I say is actual. Again after that, one day, Gurudev explaining one Upanishad Sloka. Satyam, Satyam, Jnanam, Anantyam, Brahma. Satyam, Satyam, Jnanam, Anantam, Brahma. Going to explain. There also, Gurudev speak, speaking wrongly. It is Taittari Upanishad Sloka. Taittari Upanishad Sloka. When Gurudev is explaining, then again Lakshman Deshik was very sorry. Again going to Gurudev, this kind of explanation, you know. Then Jadwar Chajo was very sure. This boy, today or tomorrow, going to crash down Mayavad. So he'll have to kill that boy. If I cannot kill this boy, I can see clearly, today or tomorrow, very shortly, that boy is going to cross down on Mayabad Bichar. Say he is going to make a you know, plan, he is plotting. What is that? Well, we all disciple, I know, all disciple and Jadavar Charjo, they all, Jadavar, it is the plan of Jadavar Charjo. We can go to Elahabad. Elahabad, you know? The, con con the confluence, the confluence of Ganga, Yamuna, Saraswati. We can go there and take bath. Well, all disciples there together going to take bath in Elava. No reason. In one kind of plotting. Because in the way of, you know, in the way of, you know, Elava, they will have to they will have to go through Bindachal Parvat. You heard the name of Bindachal Parvat? Foolish. <laughs> Bindachal Parvat, main Parvat in South India, in the middle. Bindachal Parvat, Bindachal Parvat going to make partition. South India, North India. Almost. At the bank of Bindachal, Parvat says, so many, I've been there. Narmada Nadi, coming from Bindachal, you know, Amar Kantak. So, Jadavaja took decision, okay, we will have to go through this forest, na. Then we can, you know, kill him and throw. If the situation demands so we can kill, and if we can throw him in front of tiger or lion, automatically he can die, no problem, very easy to kill. We can say what we can do, some ferocious element going to eat him up. It's very more easy, more practical, they are going. But the nephew, you know, uh, hmm, ne ne you know, brother, not nephew, you know, brother of this Lakshman Deshik, brother in the sense, you know, sister of mother, her, you know, son, that means sister of mother, you know, sister of mother. So, her son, this, you know, this your brother, in the sense. Govindo, by chance, could realize, understand the planning. Immediately, somehow, when there is a full batch going now, in row, full battalion going. In the meantime, somehow, Ramanujajo was a little backside. I mean, Lakshman Deshi. Immediately, very quickly, Govinda is going to give the information. You run away from here. They are going to plan to kill you. They are going to plan to kill you. Immediately, you run away from here. Then, Lakshman Deshi started running fast and fast through forest, only by the mercy of Bhagavan. His forest, anytime tiger, you know, and lion can come. I depend upon Bhagavan. 
And when Jadavacharya is watching, Govinda, Jadavacharya is watching, I mean the leader watching. Where is, where is Lakshman? Where is Lakshman? I don't know where is Lakshman. I thought he is coming uh, advance. Eh? What do you mean? Well, I thought he is coming advance. So I was backside, I couldn't walk properly. That's why he coming. Oh, oh. Then you search where is Lakshman is not. Then Jadava Church was very happy. Maybe some ferocious animal already, <laughs> already killed him. Okay, okay, okay. Let us go. In the meantime, Lakshman Deshik running and running and running. He was feeling, you know, tired, thirsty, no prasadam, nothing there. He is out of group, na? Finally going to take a rest near a banyan tree, big banyan tree. Going to take rest. And by chance, he is going to meet with some couple. By chance, he is going to meet with some couple. You know? Hunter, hunter couple, you know, hunter? Hunter, hunter. They are going to kill hunter couple. With tiger, screen, everything. And the woman, you know, very, you know. Then, Lakshman is asking, where you are going? You both, husband and wife? Actually, we are going to uh, take the darshan of Bharadraj. Well, you are going to Bharadraj. I am also going. You can take me. Well, you can come. But today night is there. Night time we cannot work. Better we can take rest here under this tree. And morning time we can say, well, it's good plan, good proposal. In the meantime, the wife of that hunter, I mean the couple, na? wife of that hunter, she is feeling thirsty. I need water, I can die. So trust you. Then Lakshman Deshi, I mean, Lakshman Deshi, well, I can bring water now from deep. No, it is night time. I cannot allow you to go to bring water night time. There can be every possibility of any danger. So better we can wait for the morning time to come. So in the morning time, Lakshman Desi is going to search one pond, very nice pond, and there is no pot. There is no pot. Lakshman is going to take the water from this pond, I'm going to come here, drink water. Giving to that wife of that, you know, that hunter. Three times taking water, no pot. But Ramanujaji's hand, hand is very big hand. Ramanujaji hand is not like you. Big hand, getting water. Is going to help that you know mother to drink water. When two three times done, fourth time going to bring, then you discover the where is gone. Where gone? The couple vanish. The couple vanish. Couple vanish. Where gone? Is for. And discover. There is so much noise. Jai, 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 jai. Joy who is doing in the forest? is deep forest. He discover some joy car. Then he is asking, you wonder, I was in forest. How is possible the whole people taking bath in, you know, what is the name of this place? Is Bharadraj Mandir. Oh, really? How I... I was long thousands of miles away from Bharadra's temple. Eh? How I reach? I wonder. Then he is going to inform this message to one, you know, Kanchipurno. I must explain something. I should, I should speak it before. But I, you know, he is going to explain in front of, you know, Kanchipurno. I already told two names, you forget, you can remember. One name I told Shoila Purno, the maternal uncle. I already told at the time of birth he came to give name Lakshman Desi, Shoila Purno. Now this man is Kanchi Purno. He is living little far away from their, their village house and every day he is going to, 
uh, uh, do, you know, give Puspanjali to Bharat Raj. And while going every day, that man is Vaishnava, Kanchipurna. Kanchipurna, great Vaishnava. While, can, can, while, you know, going through the, because this is the only way. Kanchipurno from his from his village. Kanchipurno from his village every day going to meet you know take darshan of Bharadraj and pray and Puspanjal. But he is every day going through the house of he is bound to go because this is the route. He is coming from his village. He is going passing through the house of you know this Lakshman Desi. Lakshman Desi watching, very small boy, eight years, nine Lakshman Desi by watching could realize that the man going is a great Vaishnava. He is also the disciple of Jamana Charju. Follow what I say. I already tell now. Shailapurno is the disciple of Jamana Charju. Kanchipurno, also the disciple of Jamana Charju. One day, a small boy going to invite that great Vaishnav. You can take prasadam in our house. Please, we are okay. I can take prasadam. Then the small boy going to serve prasadam. Like Mahaprabhu speaking now to small you know, disciple, uh, to all you know, you know, devotees. Mahaprabhu himself giving prasadam. The small boy, eight years nine, was going to serve prasadam to. Kanchi Purno, very loveful heart. You can take more this sabji, this, you know. After Prasadam is over, he is going to arrange one bed where Kanchi Purno can take rest for a little. Because after Prasadam, can take rest. And Lakshman Desi want to message the lotus feet of Kanchi Purno. Kanchi Purno, don't, don't, don't do. Don't do. I am, for a, I am from a very low family. I'm I'm from a very low caste. Lakshman Desi crying. Lakshman Desi begging. It is a Siddhanta that Vaishnav can take birth in any family. That day I was speaking, na? Eh? That day I was speaking, na? One of our Guru Bar God, he took birth in German. Eh? We like to take Uchista. His water was. I like to get is Uchista, but I am unlucky. Sadhananda Prabhu. So a Vaishnava can take birth anywhere. It matters little. It's not a big issue. The small boy giving argument, what do you say? Vaishnava is more than Brahman. But you are speaking this way to avoid my seva. I want to serve. Don't do. People can criticize. I'm from a very low caste. You are from why? High cost. Then Lakshman Deshi speaking that in our you know tradition, Lakshman Deshi speaking, Tiruppan Allah. You heard the history, Barsila Bharti Maharaj used to speak. I also speak, but most often Bharti Maharaj used to speak. Tiruppan Allah. He was from Chandal, you know, Chandal, who is a Chandal, you know, Chandal? Chandal, those who are going to in, those who are staying in crematorium ground to help you burn the dead body. They are called Chandal, very low caste. Very low caste. Tirupan Allah took birth in very low caste. Shatakopa, he also took birth in very low caste. So what? Our Haridas Thakur took birth in a very low caste. So what? So what? Chaitanya Mahaprabhu wants to dance with Haridas. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu wants to take Haridas Thakur in lap and dancing. Whereas you are going to criticize that Haridas took birth in Muslim family? Oh my God, you are an idiot. You are an offender. Don't speak that. So the small boy, Jamuna, you know, Small boy, Lakshman Tesik speaking, well, Tirupan Allah took birth in a hukas, but he is a great, more than Brahman. That day I was he hearing, na, you know, Advaita Charja, going to give Siddhanta. 
if you are going to take prasadam, Advaita Acharya is speaking to Haridas Thakur, if you are going to take prasadam, then I cannot compare, I cannot compare, I cannot compare your taking prasadam, your taking prasadam I cannot compare with crores of Brahman one side and one side you. One side you and one side crores of Brahman. If I am, you are more than that. Don't fear. I can follow Shastra, scientific. Advaita Gosa speaking. This way, if I go on speaking long Siddhanta Vichar of Ram. So, we learn from Ramanujajyo that Doiva Varnasam is very effective. Doiva Varnasam is practical. Anyway, Ramanujajyo, I mean, Lakshman Deshi wanted to take Diksha. I am going to jump because time cannot permit. I like to speak long things, so many Siddha. But what, excuse me, time cannot permit. Someday I can speak more. He wanted to take Diksha from whom? Kanchi, Kanchipurno. You can please, you can please Diksha to me. I, I can take Diksha. I am from low caste. I cannot give. I like to get Diksha from you. In the meantime, on those days, father, mother, they, 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 are, they used to arrange the marriage of son in very small age. At the age of 11 or 10, 12, they arrange marriage with some daughter. Uh, 16, I think, I forget. Arrange marriage. But the wife, Jamamba, the name of the wife, the name, you are offender, you see, you are offender, you are doing offend, big offend. Wife of, wife of Ramanushaja, his name is, you know, Jamamba. Jamamba, she was from a family tradition, a Brahmin family, and she was habituated to follow strict regulation. Strict in the sense, I am Brahman, I am high family, big, you know, all these things. Have some false ego. I am from a high caste high family. But Ramanuchajo, I mean, Lakshman Deshi was fed up. Lakshman Deshi was fed up of this kind of mood shown by wife. Anyway, then Lakshman Desi requesting, if you are not going to give initiation to me, you, you can please indicate me. Huh? You, can, you can please indicate from whom I can take Diksha. Then Kanchipurna told, well, I can ask, I can ask to, I can ask to Bharadraj Bhagavan. And if I can get answer, I can convey to you. Follow. You wait. Okay. In the meantime, in dream, Bharadraj came in the dream of Kanchipurno and speaking Mahapurno. I know. Mahapurno is a guru of <coughs> this. Mahapurno is a guru of this. He can take Diksha from Mahapurno. <coughs> In the meantime, one thing happened. What happened? Jamuna Charjo was that time, Jamuna Charjo was alive. Jamuna Charjo started hearing all the excellent power, Vaishnavi gun, qualities of Vaishnava from people about, about Lakshman Deshi. So, Jadwa, so Jamuna Charjo wanted to bring him. Jamuna Chaju wanted to bring him in his group. Quite natural, Jamuna Chaju is great sadhu. Jamuna Chaju is what to speak about to bring, you know, <coughs> what to speak about, huh, about how to bring him in group. It's automatic. Because Jadava Chaju is a great Vaishnava. And Lakshman Desi, if going to meet with Jadava Chaju, automatically he can feel inspiration. 
But point is that, what is the arrangement of Bharadraj? One day, Jamuna Chajo came to take darshan of, one day Jamuna Chajo came to take darshan of Bharadraj from long distance. He watched, from long distance he is watching that Jadava Chajo, the Mayavad Vedanta teacher, professor, and Lakshman Deshik there. He thought this is not the appropriate time to talk with him because he is with Mayavad. Okay. Long distance he could see, but he didn't, he didn't think it necessary to talk because the time is not proper time. It's not the appropriate opportunity. Gone away. Then after that planning, how to, how to bring Lakshman Desik to our group? In the meantime, Stotra Ratna. Jamuna Chajo writing nice stotra, you know stotra? Sanskrit recitation for Bharadraj. This book and giving responsibility to Mahapurno. You can go, don't speak anything. You can take the book and sit in the temple of Bharadraj and go on reciting. Don't speak anything. You can find Lakshman Deshi coming to take you can find Lakshman Deshi coming to take darshan of Bharadraj. Don't speak. You can only go on reciting, you know, what? Stotra Ratna, written by Yamuna Chaj. The Mahapurno reading, like wind reading. Lakshman Deshi from distance. Who is reciting? Oh my God, he's coming. Excuse me, if you never mind. Who writing this Stotra Ratna? Is Stotra Ratna written by my, my, my Gurudev. Who? Gurudev? Jamuna Charjo. Who? Jamuna Charjo. I like to meet him. I like, can you take me? I like to meet him. Well, I can take you with me. They fix up time. And going to meet with, you know, Jamuna Charjo. Mahapurno, going to catch, you know, Lakshman Deshi, going to meet with Gurudev. But what is the arrangement of Bharadraj? In the meantime, midway, they take information that Jamuna Chaju is no more there in the world. Oh my God. Same thing happened with our Srinivasa Chaju. Going to meet with Sarvagosai. Sarvagosai gone. To increase Vipralamba Baba. Oh, he is just going to break down hard. I was almost going to reach, almost going to reach. Oh, cry. When Mahapurno going to take, you know, Lakshman Deshik gradually there in the front of that transcendental body of that Jamuna Charju. There Lakshman Deshik, not only Lakshman Deshik, but also everybody watching the right hand finger, three finger, three finger of Jamuna Charju is folded. His lip body, lip body, but three finger is folded. Nobody understand why. Lakshman Deshi, by the mercy of Jamuna Charjo, by the mercy of Bharadraj, could realize that this, this Jamuna Charjo, great Acharya, three, three of his desire not yet fulfilled. In his life, three of his desires not fulfilled. By Vidyat Patiti, but by, by high intuition and by the mercy of Jamuna Charjo, he could take little bit information. I mean, information, talk with devotees, I mean, disciples. He could realize. He promised by touching the transcendental body of Jamuna Charjo. I promise that I can guide. All these South Indian, you know, this Dravir Amnai. Dravir Amnai means Dravir means South Indian people. I can drive, I can guide them properly by the help of giving them five sanskar, you know, pancha sanskar. You heard pancha sanskar? I can help them. I can compile all different books to guide them. I can guide them according to, you know, 
Dravir Amnai, I promise. Then when going to promise, then one finger, three finger was folded, one finger straight, open. Another, I can make the commentary of Vedanta Sutra on the basis of Bodhayan Vasya. Bodhayan is a very high uh, before Bodhayan Vasya. Then immediately second finger also open. Third finger still folded. Then you're going to promise Parasar Muni. Parasar, you know, heard the name of Parasar Muni. Going to write one Puran. Big Puran. Where he's going to guide all world, you know, different system, everything. But very complicated. Ordinary people, if they are going to go through Parasar, you know, that Puran, Then our Lakshman is speaking, I promise that I can make one ency encyclopedia. I can make one dictionary of different words written by Parasar Muni to clarify all points. Then the three finger open. Three finger open. How miracle. In the meantime, I forget to speak you. By the guidance of Kanchipurna, by the guidance of Kanchipurna, he got the scope to take Diksha, Diksha from Mahapurna. But Mahapurna is going to guide him. The mantra I am giving to you, the mantra I am going to give to you, if you would like to get more details, Analytical explanation. The mantra I'm going to give going to give you, if you like to get all analytical, sophisticated explanation of this mantra, then you will have to go to one one sadhu, his Grihastha sadhu. You will have to go to him. His name is Goshtapurna. Goshtapurna, you can confuse all Purna, Purna, Purna. What I say? What I forget? Goshtapurna. <laughs> Goshtapurna. You can go, I know, if you like to mend the analytical discussion of that mantra. It is a mystery of mantra rahasya. Okay. By the guidance of Gurudev, he is going to meet with that Guru. He was rejected 18 times. I have no time. After you can come. Today is some problem here. I, have, I cannot give time to you. Come back. This way, 18 times he was rejected. Like our Prabhupada, Like our Prabhupada was rejected 18 times by Gurkhisar Baba. Then Prabhupada said, ah. Then our Prabhupada said, I can jump into Ganga. You need not give Diksha. Because you, because you are a cheater and your, your Krishna is also a cheater. Papa speaking, your Krishna is cheater. So you are cheater. You need not give me mantra. I can jump into Ganka. Oh, you come, come, come. I can give, I can give. I can give, come, come. This way, Sadguru Vaishnava testing you. Can make you fed up. If you are not fed up, someday they can do, keep, keep up to you. You have to wait for that. Hello. This way, after 18 times, Goshtapurna could realize that 100% sincerity is there inside this heart. Well, you can come. Shit. I can give you explanation of that mantra. The mystery of mantra was analytically was express special mantra. And some special, and some special mantra was also there. Which Lakshman Acharya, Lakshman Deshik got from Goshtapurna. But Goshtapurna is going to speak don't speak this mantra to anybody. <coughs> Don't explain this mantra to anybody. Follow. Don't speak. <laughs> Ramarija, I mean Lakshman is not speaking anything. But after taking mantra, coming to you know his own bhajan kutir. In the meantime, I forget you to speak. There is so many things. How to complete? So many things. Someday I can complete. <laughs> Today not possible. Ramanujajyo wanted to cheat his wife. Ramanujajyo wanted to cheat his wife. 
is karma kandi brahman i wanted to cheat one day long one day one beggar brahman beggar going to beg something by the wife of lakshman desik i mean ramanuja going to in hey go away go away he is crying and speaking i went to beg you know some bhiksha but that lady going to speak ramanuja jo i mean lakshman desik was there lakshman desik making one plan you can go and speak to my wife that from your father's house i am coming to give you invitation letter for the marriage of your brother you can speak this a tactfully very clever <laughs> he writing one letter very artistic way so that wife cannot discover the letter is written by ramar jajju but very artistic way and sending this you can go and say actually i am coming from your father's house with an invitation letter that your marriage ceremony of your brother is going to be arranged he is going with the marriage and showing the letter to jamamba oh you are coming from my father's house come come sit and giving big prasadam everything go <laughs> big prasadam after that in the meantime very tactfully jam and you know, lakshman desh is coming in front of wife what happens you are you are dancing you are so happy actually you see this uh, this man you know the sadhu coming with the invitation like what in my brother's marriage oh you should go you must go lakshman desh you must go his brother's marriage you cannot go i can go after first you go because you are you are responsibility but it is my request you can go all your important clothes you know sari all important sari and ornament you should because time to time you have to change na ornament ha eh? ah you are you are right you are you are speaking to husband right you are i can carry all my uh, ornament and uh, important clothes you can carry and i give the man that man can help you to travel you know go in the meantime when wife gone ramanujaji i mean lakshman desh is coming to baradraj with tears rolling down his cheeks and going prabhu prabhu i leave my wife from today onward you can say i am only yours i leave my wife prabhu from today i am the sole property your property i am my life is now totally dedicated immediately ramanujaji going in front of you know in front of ananta sarovar ananta sarovar there is one peak lake ananta sarovar very auspicious you will have to take everybody take him by at the bank of ananta sarovar ramana charya putting the picture of jamuna charya and going to take tea danda i mean going to take danda not tea danda going to take danda from the picture of jamuna charya i am taking danda after that he become famous he become famous as as ramanuja charya from then onward different kind of thing in the meantime i already explain he got special mantra and mysterious some day i can explain more details but today not going to take mantra gurudev singh don't speak this mantra and explanation mystery to anybody <laughs> straight away is coming in front of 70 in front of 78 disciple openly is speaking that mantra <laughs> whereas gurudev you don't speak mantra to anybody he is going to make them sit it in a room and loudly speaking this mantra give mantra to everybody then goshtapurna was very angry some day he meet with goshtapurna you are going to hell you are surely going to hell i told you not to give this mantra to anybody why you give ramar chajyo is folded hands swing oh gurudev actually i am a very fallen soul if at all i am going to hell because i already told the mantra to thousands of uh, hundreds of people for this for this reason if at all i am i am 
for at all for this I am supposed to go to hell, then what is the what is the profit and loss? Because I am successful to give this mantra to hundreds of people, I can deliver them, so I can go to hell. I am ready to go to hell because I can deliver them because I speak the mantra. Then Gostapurna can realize the soft heart. Gostapurna immediately could realize the soft heart of Ramanacharya. Is very happy. I told that you are supposed to go to hell because your idea, Siddhanta, which is very high. So you are not going to hell. Then Gostapurna going to allow, then Gostapurna going to allow his own son. Gostapurna going to allow his own son to take Diksha from, uh, from you know, Ramanushaja. His own son, he could give Diksha now. You can take, he is a great exalted. So many things. I have no time to explain. So, what to do? I am very fearful. Anyway, this way actually, finally, Ramanushaja, Ramanushaja wanted to, you know, compile Vedanta Sutra. But how to do? He took information. The original manuscript written by Bodhayan, the previous Acharya, is secretly, is secretly kept by Mayavadis. Secretly kept by Mayavadis in Kashmir, you know, Kashmir, hilly place. Sharada Pit. How to go? Long distance. So with Kuresh, I'm going to cut short. With Kuresh, one disciple of Ramanushaja. Is a Kures is Ramangsa. Ramanujajo is a, a descendant of a, a Lakshman. And Kures is Ramangsa. And Govinda is Bharat Angsha. Bharat, Bharat, you know? Is going there to reach that their ashram and they are require and going to inquire. You have the Bodha and Basha here, I heard. No, no, no Bodhan Basha. No Bodhan Basha. What is Bodhan Basha? They simply say, no. Because if the Bodhan Basha, if somebody is going to read, then they can understand when Mayavadi is all, you know, false. So they are going to protect that Bodhan Basha very secretly. Then Ramanujaj is Ramanujaj just thinking what to do. He is praying to, you know, Nishinga Dev, Nishinga Dev. Because deity, they are Nishinga Dev. Oh Prabhu, what to do? Then in the meantime, night time, Nishinga Dev appear with the Bodha and Basha from the Almira. Everything is possible for Bhagavan. Lock and key. But Bodha and Basha, Nishinga Dev taking in hand, you give to Lakshman Desi and uh, Ramanuja. You take. Immediately, immediately run from here. In the night time, Kuresh, Kuresh and Ramanuja running, 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 and you know, gone without speaking to anybody, long distance. In the meantime, they search, they find the Bodhan Basha is missing. Oh, they must have stolen. They must have stolen. Seven and eight very powerful, stout figure men are going to send. Go, follow him. Anyhow, do or die. I have to rescue that Bodhan Basha. You catch him, beat them. They are running for one month. One month they are continuously running. After that, they are going to meet with Ramanushaju. Going to fight with him. Going to snatch away. Going to snatch away that Buddha and Basha. Keep. <clears throat> going to beat them. Ramanushaju, great Vaishnava, not going to fight. Taken away. Ramanushaju feeling hopeless. Oh Prabhu, I was almost <coughs> I was almost successful, but no failure. What to do? How to compile? I promise already. In the meantime, Kure speaking to Gurudev, Gurudev, don't lament. In one month, one month every day night time, one month, when we are traveling, one month, in the night time I was reciting. This Bodha and Basu, I memorize everything. Eh? You memorize? Bula, huh? 
Whole Vedan Basa I can remember. You can remember? Yes. Very shortly I can write you, give you. Ramacharya has a start. <laughs> By Guru Kipa, what is not possible? Kure is going to compile all what he read. Whole one month, night time, going to recite. He memorize, he's going to write and give it to Guru Dev. Here you are. Ramanacharya was very happy, bless him. Then Ramanacharya was successful to compile. I can come so many things. In the meantime, Mayavadi uh, Sampradaya, they wanted to kill Ramanacharya many times. In Madurai, there was a very ferocious king. His name is Krimikantha. Krimikantha. He was Shaiva. Shaiva means Shiva. He went to do Shaiva. He wanted to defeat Rama, Ramanucharya. But in the meantime, when some messenger coming to convey the message of Krimikantha to come to his kingdom, otherwise there is a big problem. Can happen. They can fight and kill. Then without informing, without giving information to Ramanujaja Gurudev, Kurya speaking, Kurya speaking to those messengers, who is Ramanujaja? Kurya speaking, I am Ramanujaja. You Ramanujaja? Yes. With the dress of Danda, Kuresh is not sannyas. Kuresh taking Danda and taking all the dress of Ramanujaja and going to meet with Krimikanta. Your name is Ramanujaja? Yes, my name. You will have to change your, change your, you know, bhajan. You have to become saiva. Actually, I am. No, you have to change. Otherwise, it can kill you. Or you will have to accept our, you will have to accept our saiva mantra. You will have to become saiva. Otherwise, it can kill you. Well, the unnecessary argument took place. Argument took place. Kuresh was so powerful. He was successful to defeat all Mayabad Bisharuji, finally they find there is no way out. They are taking Kuresh forcefully, three or four men forcefully, and going to eradicate the eyes, take out eyes. They are going to eradicate the eyes of Kuresh. Kuresh blood coming out, Kuresh blind, you know, by the help of some beggar, finally going to reach Gurudev. Gurudev, after watching, started crying. What happens? There is a case. Then Ramanujajyo is going to take, you know, Kuresh with him, going to reach the lotus feet of Bharadraj. Prabhu, for me, for you, Kuresh is going to give his eyes. Prabhu, you give back his eyes. Then from that day onward, Kuresh is going to develop such a Darshanik, you know, eyes, he can see everything. Not materialize, transcendental eyes. What to speak? I like to touch today, no time cannot permit. Point is that Ramanuja Siddhanta, Shakti Siddhanta. Ramanuja speaking, the Siddhanta is Vishishta Daitabhag. Someday I can explain. Ramanuja speaking, all jivas, they are the body of Brahma, but one kind of special expression of Brahma. It's okay. That's why Vishishta. Vishishta means special expression of Brahma. Follow. All jivas are Shakti Angsha. In Gita, someday I can explain, today time cannot permit. Shakti Siddhanta, we know from. Uh, we know from Gita, Mamai Bhangsa Jeeva Loka Jeeva Bhuta Sanatana. Mamai Bhangsa, Bhagavan speaking. What do you mean by Mamai Bhangsa? My, my part? If Bhagavan speaking, Mamai Bhangsa, they are Jeevas, they are all my part and particles. Do you think Bhagavan is there? We are going to you know, make the particle of Bhagavan, cut into pieces, and that particle? You think so? Try to follow what I mean. By, when Bhagavan is going to speak, that Mamai Vamsa Jiva Luka Jiva Uttasana, you think Bhagavan is divided into infinite part and one one part is Jiva? Not that. That Siddhanta, someday I can explain. Now today I can only speak this much. 
that jivas are shakti, shakti angsha. Jivas are not the answer of Bhagavan. Since we know the Siddhanta, we know the Siddhanta, na? That day I was speaking. Eh? Shakti, Shakti, Matur, Avet. I mean, Bhagavan and his Shakti, non different from each other. That's why this Siddhanta. Someday I can explain. So, Mamai Vamsa Jiva Loke means the particle of the you know, potency, Shakti of Bhagavan. That also, uh, during my Jivatma, uh, Jivatma, I was explaining. That Jeep Tatta, I mean uh, Tatasta Sakti, simultaneously inside Bhagavan or outside? Not actually inside. How possible? Inconceivable power. Inconceivable power. Power. That at the time it is saw, it outside means outside, inside means how it is possible simultaneously? Yes. As per Chatusraki Bhagavata. Javanaham Jatha Bhava Yadrupa Guna Karmakaha Tathiva Vigyana Vasute Madhanu Guhat. Riti artham jat pratiyato na pratiyato chatmani tad vidyad atmano mayam jathavasa jathatmaha jathah mahanti bhutani ucchava chishonu pravishthanu pravishthani tathah teshu na teshu ham. Bhagavan speaking, simultaneously or infinity world inside me and outside me. Not inside me. How is possible? Now you say inside? Yes. That is all my power. There is more power, exceptional power. You cannot play your brain and understand, find solution. So we are going to take, we Gauriyas, we will take Shakti Siddhanta from Ramanujajya. Excuse me, today I have no time to explain, time is over. Tadeva Ramam Nuchiram Navam Navam Tadeva Shashyadamana Soma Savam Tadeva Sokarnava Soshanam Ninam Jaduttama sloka onu gi hati. One chakal paturu shiki pass in the bachu. Pasitan and Pavan and Bavishna Bhuram. Jaisi Ramanuja Charjoji Maharaj ki jay. At the age of 78, 79, he lived body today. We like to crave, we are, we are praying cravingly to get the keeper of Ramanuja Charjo. One chakal paturu